Scott's pit crew in Danville is preparing for its biggest project ever. Yeah, it's such a big undertaking, the organization's founder says it actually feels impossible. 10 News reporter Coulter Anstead explains what the organization is trying to do and why. It's heart-wrenching, I know, for these teachers. It's heart-wrenching for everybody in the community. Pictures on God's Pit Crew founder Randy Johnson's iPad show what's left of Moffitt Public School in Moffitt, Oklahoma, after the town was flooded by six to eight feet of water in May from the nearby river. God's Pit Crew plans to rebuild the school, expecting to work to cost at least $250,000. All the books, all their cafeteria, all the serving trays for the kids. I mean, the whole thing, it's all just devastated. Johnson went to Moffitt to see the devastation firsthand after receiving a video from a pastor. It was just awful uh, what the video showed. And sure enough, when we got there, um, it was one of the most heartbreaking scenes I've ever seen. So this has uh, um, been mon monumental for our school. After interviews and a lot of praying, he says he called Moffitt's superintendent and told him God's pit crew would be back. He said, thank God, we're not alone anymore. In interviews with God's pit crew, school staff members echoed that feeling. We're so thankful and so grateful for you guys because now we've got the hope that we need. It is going to mean uh, more than we could ever even think. Johnson hopes to start working on the school in August and have it usable by the end of the month. We believe with all of our heart it's something we're supposed to do, and we're just praying that others will join with us and help us. In Danville, Colter Anstat, 10 News, working for you.